Here's why you should stop pressuring your child. You love your children and you want what's best for them. You make sure they eat healthy, are physically active, loved and nurtured. But we live in a competitive culture and you have to prepare them. In this always comparing, always judging and fast moving society you, as a responsible parent, make sure that your child receives the best chances in life. But is this constant goal reaching attitude really what's best for your children? Or should a carefree childhood be reclaimed? You've learned that you will only receive the best paid job, if you are the best. In order to be the best, you have to attend the best schools. You know that it's important to start early with the best education. If your children don't attend the best preschool they will not get into the best high school and then they won't get into an Ivy League college. In order to defy competition you set high goals for your children, because that's the only way for them to become successful adults. Your children are top of their class? Good. Now, let's make them win the physics olympiad while adding the violin to their hobbies. Not to forget multiple sports, of course. You believe you just lay the foundation of success. Unfortunately, you probably didn't. Setting high expectations doesn't have to be a bad thing, as long as you consider your child's response to them. When being pushed too far, your children may develop nightmares or start pulling out their own hair. They may start using drugs, for example to improve their performance in school tests. Or they develop a homework resistance, anxieties and low confidence. And you won't be the only one putting pressure on your children. In order to please you, the parent, your children will add even more pressure. Your children will believe that they are only loved, if they succeed. Why? Don't you love your child, if it makes mistakes? If it fails in a test? Stop adding pressure to the one your children face every day. Their teachers pressure them, as well as their friends. You are not your child's coach. Allow them to make mistakes, allow them to be carefree. Become your child's supporter and biggest fan. Don't make your love dependent on their success. Accept and love them for who they are, not for who they could be. Simply put, be their parent, 